hi guys so i just received this parcel and that i'm going to open it in front of you guys Hey guys so i am going to do my hair at all and i just ordered for an uber it's on its way to be here pretty soon and i'm almost late the train is at 9 45 and it is literally 9 31 i'm still here i pray that this uber will be fast enough to get me there before the time so yeah these are my stuff so i have my hair in this bag and then I packed some here as well, so yeah. Let's get it, guys. So this is me at the car park and waiting for the Uber. The Uber driver, please hurry up and come home, guys. It is 9.35, so 10 minutes more. If he's not fast enough, I am doomed. But he's almost here though, so I'm at the car park and waiting. I'm at the car park and waiting. So guys, the driver just gets... So guys, the driver just got here and yeah, we are rushing there. I'm just praying. Oh God, help me to be able to arrive there before because the train will pick up at... i did miss my train and i decided to you know just come to the cafe i have to wait for the next train which is in the next like 45 minutes so i decided to have a breakfast since i didn't have any chocolate hot, hot chocolate hot chocolate yeah small medium small, small. then uh i don't know if i should check this one and then one of these croissants yeah i finally got my breakfast it took about five minutes maximum to be able to get everything and yeah about to consume it since i'm here till 45 minutes can you imagine the moment i got there before i even reached the train station the other train had left so I just had to wait and I'm really enjoying the hot chocolate and my own croissant. I don't know if I'm getting the name right, croissant. <laughs> so finally 45 minutes is in and then yeah it's time and we are all seated and ready to go. And at this point guys because I had to wait extra 45 minutes, my, the time that I booked to go braid my hair that time had passed and the lady kept calling because she said she had other stuff to do you know and i was literally like delaying her you know because once you book an appointment you have to be there for the appointment at the appointed time but then i'm 45 minutes late and the train is now moving and from there to hall is like one hour also almost one hour from york to home okay guys so i am finally in the beautiful city of hall and i'm about to take a bus from the train station to her place and hooray i am there she's it's not really a salon like she braids the hair in her house so i'm actually there now and yeah oh god my hair is finished at this point i had serious headache have you even noticed the veins on my forehead yeah it was really tight you know they might pick a picky head i say i won't blood that's on this is the hair i'm going to use to braid and i got it at a cheap price on ebay 
Tell the thing. They saw my face on. Oh. on my face. My forehead is What's it called? Mm, just because I'm braiding my hair. Mm, guys it seems the hair wouldn't reach because this is the last hair and then my own hair is still plenty so i don't know so she's trying to braid the center one bigger than usual you know because the fourth hair wouldn't reach the attachment wouldn't really reach my hair so she's making it bigger so that i won't get some braided hair and some unbraided hair you know oh I'm almost done. I'm excited. <laughs> Finally, guys, braids are done. Look at these beautiful braids and this beautiful girl. I'm super excited, guys. Finally, it is over. How do I look? And how is the hair? Comment down below your thoughts. Got done and about to pay the lady. The bank app said it didn't open, so she had to follow me to town there where I had network to be able to pay her. Yeah. Go, 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 go. We are finally in town now, and at this time, the bank app decided to open, and I paid her. It was so disgraceful, you know, but it is what it is. So I finally paid them, and they left. And now I'm in the train back to York. Yeah, I'm super tired because you know I spent more time on the because I didn't go as planned. I had to close later than expected, you know, because she had other stuff she was doing as well. Hi, my loves. I'm Lady Senimado, and welcome back to my channel. So, yes, guys, I am going on a vacation. I mean, I've never, never traveled internationally just for a vacation. This is the first time. So I want to bring you guys along, guys. It's going to be fun. So I am about to pack my stuff. And of course, I cannot leave you guys behind, in it. So yes, let's pack together, guys. Come along. So I've got all these stuff that I have to pack, guys. So as usual, I'm bringing you guys along. Let's pack them too. So I bought some stuff from Shane and I've been keeping it a while now. And I want to just sort it's out you know because it's not everything that i'm supposed to wear it's too much honestly so i'm sorting out a few that i will take and put the remaining one back and i also got stars from pretty little thing so i'm also going to you know sort that one out as well that one i might need all of them it's not like the shane one the shane i i bought i think i bought things from there thrice or so so yeah that's another bag from pretty little thing everything i bought from pretty little thing i'm wearing them except the shame so yes these are the ones that i eventually want to take with me but then i have to sort them out you know to make it the packing easier since the bag i'm using is really small you guys will see it very small so i need to arrange them in a way that everything will fit so yeah i'm still unloading some of the stuff that i got from sheen so i try to you know separate them blouses one side those are the blouses my dress just one dress my pants and this is the sweater my belt um, my headgear and my accessories in that bag and my hat over there and this is my glasses my pretty little thin glasses so now I'm facing the challenge of trying to pack everything in my small bag. So let's get back. So I'm coming to pack all of these things into this. Because I'm trying to create space. You always get transparent bag like this for your liquids. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to put my liquid and other stuff in it. Not just liquids too. This is my hand cream and then my body butter so hand and body cream but then i'm adding this glow oil because i'm naturally somebody who have a dry skin so just the hand the body cream wouldn't be enough so 
So guys, my advice is don't wait for last minute before you start to pack. It's the same day that I'm going to be traveling that I'm packing, you know. So it was a bit hectic, but I just had to maneuver and, and go through. And then I had to work the previous days. So that's why it happened that way. But yeah, I always pack ahead of time. Oh, then I think there's even space here. I can put something because I wanted to use this bag. I do have stuffs here. These were the stuffs given to me on my flight to the UK. I think I'll, I'll have to use them. This is too fresh. And they do have little lip balm here to come in handy. Yeah, this is another body lotion, which I might not use. I already have two. And this is toothpaste. So for the three days I'll be there, I think this toothpaste is enough. And then they have this blindfold and earplug for noise and all those stuff. So I think I will carry this bag. So I'll just put the extra stuff in here. So... I've gotten two of it now all of the smaller stuff so it's left with the bigger stuff oh no this one i have to take maybe two of it i nearly forgot to pack my earrings but thank god i've remembered i'll just put it in the small space that is left in this transparent bag yeah so guys basically these are everything that i'm going to be taking yes mind you we are going to spend just the weekend so we leave we go on friday and then we'll come back monday in the evening so these are the stuffs and i made it easy this way so for instance this one i'm going to be wearing the top and the down so i put them together you know so this is also top and the pants i put them together i did the same with this and i added extra blouse should in case i want to change because the attire that i'm going to be wearing to go i'm going to be wearing this to go and the top is white so i added extra tops so in case you know and aside that because i'll be wearing jeans you know jeans you can pair it with any other blouse so i'm just adding this extra top one night wear because we will hardly sleep we'll just be moving around you know and this is another top and down this another up and down this is my dress and yeah so far so good i simplified it this way i'm not going to be taking too much so i think this is supposed to cover up for the basically three days we are going to be there for so yeah i'm coming to pack them in the suitcase and get going so this is the case that um i'll be using for the strip so i did order this case from tiktok shop and I don't know, but it appeared smaller than I thought it would be. But I mean, it's all good because I really need small suitcase since I'm going to place it under my seat. So this is just the wheels. So you can actually remove the wheels and put I want to back. use one side for shoes and one side for clothes. But guys, the shoes, I don't know just this one alone just a pair of uh, one foot to the whole space you know so i think i'm going to wear this one rather to go so i'll wear one to go then i go with one but then i also want to take something flat along with me <sighs> you cannot even take any extra stuff guys i don't know i want to take this with me you know something to free the legs like when we are going for the cruise, you wouldn't want to wear sneakers throughout. But then, it's literally full, you know. So I have to work this magic to be able to, I don't know guys. Because I need to take slippers. I do have, I think I bought slippers. I want to take this with me. It's time to work that magic. I've actually placed every top into the, the down, whether trousers or skirt. And then I'll fold them together, you know so that it will fit and the reason why i'm taking this small suitcase is that it's a cheap flight and as such you have to put your bag under your seat so meaning you you need a small bag if the bag is big they will charge you and i don't want to pay anything extra you know 
so i had to work that magic and make sure everything fits so that i won't pay anything extra and be able to enjoy my flight so as you guys can see i'm still working the magical everything must fit so with the clothes i had no much problem as you can see guys i've tried and tried and tried but this, this shoe cannot fit i mean i'm really sad because i really really wanted like you know two sneakers to move around but it seems i might wear only one i don't know i will choose between this and this i might wear only one which one do you think i should take guys the brown or the black i might just take this african stuff with these other ones and just go so it's time to work magic on the shoes too i'm tired worrying you know i'm just going to pack whatever that can fit and i have to leave the brown sneakers behind i'm sad about it i really wish that i could take two sneakers with me but it seems impossible so i just work with what i have i actually reduced the earrings i'm only taking these ones because uh, i got tired stressing out so it's okay so i've cleared the side and now let's close it. Oh. <sighs> so I am attaching the wheels now so that it will make it easier for me to wheel it to the airport. But once I get there before... I sit down, you know, I place it under my chair. I'll have to remove the wheels to make it fit better. So that is just what I'm doing and time to attach my hat to make it easier, you know. So I'm trying to attach the hat to the suitcase, as you can see. And it fitted perfectly well and I'm super excited, guys. It's time for snacks. So I'm going to be packing these snacks with me on the trip. Yes, should in case I miss a uk snack i can you know hold on to that so let's pack them together i still have the snack that i i brought from ghana the interior or the popcorn like snack so the snack is all done it will be with me like it didn't fit in the suitcase so i'll just hold it you know okay guys so finally i am done it wasn't easy Ta-da! I'm all set now to travel. And as I said, I'm just going to be wearing the black shoes because I cannot take the brown one with me. And I was able to ta -da, put my passport in this thing as well. So yeah, all set, all good. I just need to go take a shower. Then I, he I start heading to London. So thank you so much for packing with me i really do appreciate it comment down below if you think i did well with my packing skills because trust me this bag is like the smallest of its kind the smallest but i was able to you know stuff everything in and these are the stuff that i'm going to be wearing to go so i place them here so that i wouldn't forget anything okay so i'm going to take a shower and then get back to you guys thank you so much for packing with me and see you in my next video until then Bye.